300 hotels across our state are preparing to become a quarantine zone for returning travellers forced to live in lockdown for two weeks. The strict new rules are just hours away from being enforced as part of the latest bid to contain COVID-19. From 9 o'clock tonight, any Australians returning from overseas won't be going home, but somewhere like this service department in Perth's CBD instead. We're trying to figure out the best way that we can use 140 locations we have across Australia uh, and 11,000 service departments to uh, support the situation. To slow the spread of COVID-19, anyone arriving into Australia, regardless of their final destination, will go into mandatory quarantine at a hotel for two weeks. Quest East Perth ready to add more guests to its list of those already self-isolating at the complex. At this point in time, we've got 27 uh, guests that are self-isolating. Australian Hotels Association says it has recommended 300 hotels across the state ready to house overseas passengers. They range from two-star hotels up to five-star and can be anything from hotels, motels, apartments, caravan parks or student accommodation. Returning travellers won't pay the state government to pick up the bill instead. The hotel industry is ready, ready, willing and able to support. Um, this, of course, it comes in a time when the hotels have only got around 10% on average occupancy. Um, there's plenty of room. Extra hygiene measures are already being rolled out and hotel staff are on standby. Our understanding is, is that hotel staff might be used in back of house areas, for instance in the kitchens, working preparing meals. If this hotel becomes a quarantine zone, it will fall under the control of a law enforcement officer with the assistance of the Australian Defence Force, ensuring guests remain in their rooms. It's a scenario already playing out in the eastern states. Well, we have to stay for the next 14 days. This is our hotel room, the lovely view with the police on guard. A new reality for those in lockdown at this Sydney hotel and possibly a taste of what's to come here. Yep. You need to stay in your room. What's your name? My name is Constable Perry from Sydney City Police. Oliver Haig, Nine News.